Good morning, everyone. This is Greg Silva. We are still working in the month of June for Black Belt Excellence. Uh, the topic is being strong or strength, and we're going to tie that into the principles of Black Belt. Principles of Black Belt is a creed quite a few schools use at the end of the class. So before the kids ball out, uh, they say the, uh, the principles of Black Belt. What are the principles of Black Belt? People say, as a dedicated student of the martial arts, we will live by the principles of black belt. Modesty, courtesy, integrity, perseverance, courage, and indomitable spirit. Our goal is black belt excellence and we lead by example. So that'd be the creed. If you're not doing that creed, it may be something that you'd want to add to your class. If you're already doing it, that's great. This will even be easier as far as the black belt excellence on strength. Because when we have all these principles of black belt excellence, we are strong. And I want to kind of tie that message into you're not just strong, but you're wolf pack strong. If I, I just happen to think of uh, Steve Baxley's school is wolf pack. So his kids are wolf pack strong. Um, Sal Cavento's students are United States Black Belt Academy strong. Uh, Steve D. Castile. They are Krav Maga martial arts strong. So whatever the name of your school is, that's how strong your students are. So we're going to just talk about this and say, guys, we're not only strong, we are East-West Karate strong. And we would actually start and end the class with that at uh, the beginning. So instead of just doing a regular bow-in, I have to kind of explain that we're East-West Karate strong, or whatever the name of your school is strong. All the kids are going to get around you. We're all going to put our hands in a circle. How strong are we? And they'll go, East-West Karate strong, sir. So the whole idea is they get their strength by going to your school. We want them to really understand that. We want the parents to understand that. Because they are East-West Karate strong, they have the principles of black belt. They're showing modesty, courtesy, integrity, perseverance, courage, and indomitable spirit. So now you're going to look for opportunities to teach these in class. And so maybe you have the opportunity for courtesy. Hey, uh, parents, you know, one of the things that we do when we do our creeds is all the parents stand up. And it's just being courteous to the kids. Hey, guys, we do the same thing um, when we walk into the school. We always bow onto the mat. That's being courtesy to uh, showing courtesy to all the instructors. You're saying yes, sir, no, sir, to your parents and to your teachers. Again, showing courtesy. That's part of the things that makes us strong. And so then you put your hands in the center, and then they go, East West Karate Strong, sir. Maybe you're doing it in a drill, and you're doing some type of spinning kicks. And it's going, but it's not going great, so you practice it over and over and over again. Now you do the, have everyone sit down at the end of class go, guys, i got to tell you, I'm so proud of you today. Because you really demonstrated today one of the principles of Black Belt. Um, what we did with today was a little bit difficult. And some of you guys had a hard time. Some of you guys had an easy time. But the thing is, we constantly persevered. We didn't give up. You know, we talked uh, last week about being mentally strong. So we know today, you know, if to get this kicked down, it's going to take some perseverance. You're mentally strong. But not only are you mentally strong, you have all those tenets of a black belt. So we are East-West strong. So we bow out today. I want everyone to just come around me, put the hands in the center. I'm going to go, how strong are we? And you're going to go, East-West karate strong. Again, I'm just saying East-West karate because that was my school. Whatever your school is, uh, that's what you can do it. So throughout the week, you've got six days. We have six tenets of the black belt. Modesty, courtesy, integrity, perseverance, courage, and indomitable spirit. You're going to just mention one of those after each day, and that's uh, that type of strength because they have that type of principle, and that makes them what name of your school is strong. So they're not just strong, they're, you know, cloverleaf karate strong, whatever the, the name of your school is. So that's the goal. This is week three. Uh, I may be doing a bonus one. I really love this, a month of strength. It's so easy to get a theme for the class. Again, your mat chat is important, but doing a theme throughout the class is what really empowers the kids. So we're talking about strength. We're talking about not giving up. We're talking about physical strength, pushing our ways through things. You may talk to the kids about being mentally strong. So if they're challenged, maybe uh, the parents taught them all these values. Parents taught them about being uh, you know, nice to other people and not to steal and you know, all these uh, worthwhile values. Sometimes those are going to be challenged. 
you know, especially with uh, younger teens and tweens. Uh, they may be tempted by some kids at school trying to sell them drugs or trying to take them uh, drugs, but they are East West karate strong. They have all these principles, so they're not going to do it. So educating the students, educating the parents on strength, on mental strength, on physical strength, but you're not just strong. You're strong because you come to this martial arts school. So you're KMA strong. Enjoy it. It's a fun one. Thank you.